Creating Text Macros. This video will demonstrate how to create and insert a macro into a note. From within the note, there are three icons. The first icon will always appear on the clinical toolbar and you may click there to create a macro. The second icon with the check mark will allow you to create a task. Again, you can create a macro from within a task. The third icon with the lightning bolt appears within a note. This is the macro icon we'll be using for this demo. I'll navigate to the lower left and click Create. The yellow fields are required mandatory fields. The name of this macro will be Anxiety. The period is already there for you. Just type the name of the macro. The description field is optional. Here I'll enter Treatment Plan. On the right, there's a Show Merge Fields button. Merge fields will be pulled into the electronic health record. They personalize the macro. In this example, first name, last name will be selected, as well as patient date of birth and patient medical record number. The three merge fields I selected appear on the left and side brackets. The script must be typed accurately because this is exactly what will be inserted each time the macro is used. I will add additional information to this macro. Now that seems like a lot of typing to do, but in a moment, the power of the macro will be demonstrated. On the lower left of the screen, there's a spell check button. Words with a red squiggly line can be changed using spell check. This works much like Microsoft Word. So I'll click on spell check on the lower left. The merge fields that are inside the brackets sometimes will appear as typos. Ignore once and ignore all can be selected to move forward. Caffeine is misspelled. The suggestion here for caffeine is correct. When I click change, the change will be made. Support and system are both misspelled. These can be corrected by clicking change. Click OK on the spell checker dialog box. My macro is good to go. So let's click Save on the lower right to close the Create New Macro screen. And then let's click Close on the lower right to close the Manage Macro screen. This macro will be inserted into the plan area of this note. Once again, and this is a key point, a macro can be inserted anywhere you may free text. Examples would include unstructured notes, task as well as notes. Type a period first and then the macro. The period is an essential part of the macro. After typing the macro, press the enter key on the keyboard. This populates the plan field with the contents of the macro. Our macro reads the patient's name, date of birth, medical record number presented today in clinic with anxiety. Start one milligram of Xanax PRN. Advise patient to eliminate caffeine, take yoga three times weekly, and identify a support system at the church the patient attends. If you have any additional questions, please contact your Allscripts systems analyst.